So, 2019 was the year that kind of the same way that it started with Israel bombing Syria on some fuck shit while they were busy celebrating the weekend. And now I'm posting on Twitter and the dissident movement by proximity voicing their concerns and their support and the rest of the ideological spectrum for the most part kind of weaving this subject and focusing on the political distractions of the world. And really what I gotta say about all of that is that usually this sets up for a framing of events. In modern mythic structures Things usually start and end in the same way, relatively. But it's what's in between the journey that... That's like the real meat of the subject. So I think it's interesting that we're in a position right now as a newly branded dissident movement where expressing our views is even more of an inconvenience now. Like, I've recently been deplatformed off of Facebook. And it wasn't even for saying anything, it was just my friends list and shit. And I got homies, I can DM on Instagram and Skype who can attest to this. It's, uh, it's not even what you say anymore, it's like who you be around. These algos be wallowing. But even more than that, it's like uh, the level of backstabbing and fighting has gotten ridiculous. And the bigger tent of the dissident movement, where like the, there's this stuff with Groypers and Wormy Cons like Charlie Kirk, where uh, Nick Fuentes was starting this thing where he would question these Wormy conservatives because you know, new conservatives are pro gay, they're you know pro left on everything except healthcare views, you never have enough money to provide everyone with decent healthcare, and Israel. That's like the thing they care about. Everything else, you know, they got the pride flags and stuff like that. But what I notice is that, like, all these different factions, regardless of whether Donald Trump represents them, I think the normie cons are more represented in Trump's administration and the Grapers are what we thought Trump was representing during his campaign and how like different those narratives are if you don't pay attention. And it's gotten to a point where I've realized that the big excuse people use for continuing to support Donald Trump, even as it has inconvenienced their lives, literally signed uh, stuff, bills, that makes it harder to criticize Israel. To criticize Zionistic policies and actions. And on top of that, it really feels like, yeah, they want to use Donald Trump as a platform, that's the excuse. Like, it's no longer a system of voting for a party, it's like voting for Donald Trump for your party of Trump supporters. Like, he's become the platform in and of itself. I'm starting to doubt he's really that big. Where, like, different factions of people competing to vote for the same guy. Like, are white liberals who have Trump disenfranchised and send them going to start voting for the guy too? That'd be some ingredient amplify shit right there, like, yo, I'm sick of this orange man. I'm gonna vote for him so that he does what I want him to do this time, which is get himself impeached, get himself out of there. And, you know, he did get impeached. But he's still signing crazy shit. So what good is it gonna do? Nothing, really. So in that way, our lives are way more inconvenient now than they were even when the year started. But the, the 
fact that it ended the same way is proof that, like, this is a filler year. It is, if life was an anime, this would be like, oh shit, we caught up to the manga, we gotta, like, uh, do some fuck shit now for, like, six to twelve months. One year filler, that's fucking crazy. That'll cancel one anime. But for us, it's some red shit. Like, we're just waiting for the World War Three war arc that's gonna like end part two, and, like lead to another time skip for like the epilogue and shit. So, anyway, pale as a motherfucker now. It's been a year and a half since I uploaded. Like, I used to be a sun-kissed motherfucker. Now I'm you know, back to my pale roots and shit. So. This has been Mr. Monka 7. Suck my dick.